Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to the channel. We're well, out here today at the Skyway. I'm on the South Pier, targeting some Spanish mackerel. I'm out here today with my creator. I got pops with me. He's setting up. He already got broke off twice, actually. And uh, let me show you guys what he caught. And this is just him by himself. Check it out, guys. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. He already hooked up it to, uh, he already hooked up with seven. So, I'm out here with my uh, pan slammer, 4500. Nice, my toadfish rod. This is a seven foot six, medium heavy action. And all I'm doing is using all I'm doing is using a long shank hook with some live bait. So guys, hopefully you enjoyed this video and I'll be right back with you. Free line in. I'm gonna put them through the nostril. Next, I'm gonna hook them through his mouth. Just like that. Let's see how he goes. All right, guys. Okay, everybody, my first cast. And it's extremely windy, so. Yeah, I might have to put a split shot because he's taking a long time to get to go straight down. There you go, guys. Oh, I had him. I had him, but he spit it. He spit it back out. Let's try it again. I need a split shot. I can see my bait right there. Oh, he took it. Let me get a split shot. Okay, I put on two split shots. Let's see how it goes. Let's see. Alright guys, hooked into the first one. You guys see him? It's a nice one. Alright, that's the first one. That's the first one for me. And this is why I use long shank hooks. You see how far he is from the line? He won't cut my line. Check it out, guys. Try it again. Check it out. Split shot, two of them. I'm using 50 pound mono for my leader and long shank hook. Right, 
got hit. I got hit again. He took it. Another one. Nice one. Ooh. That's a nice one. That's a nice one right there, guys. Fork, he's 19 inches. Check it out, guys. 19 inches. 19 inches to the fork. Let's put him in a cooler. I know. You foul hooked him. using What I'm doing is I'm casting it straight out and I'm feeling when that weight hits the bottom. Once it hits the bottom is when I start reeling in real quick. Then I'll stop halfway, let it go back to the bottom again, and repeat. Just start reeling real quick. So you hit the bottom ready. I'll stop. Sometimes when you stop, the macro will hit it on the way down. got tons of bait here by the by the pier so what I'm doing also is I'm casting it to the side of the pier
Ay, Amy. ¿Y dónde está? All right, guys, we're packing up, getting ready to leave. It's almost time for me to get ready for work. So this is what me and my pops got today. It's the Mac attack. Bite was on fire this morning. And honestly, we caught just about all of these with the uh, spoons we had live bait caught maybe three four with live bait and then the rest was just spoons i was happy to see my dad having a good time he had a blast this morning he loved it so like i said it's always great to be around him you know he's not getting any younger so just want to spend as much time as possible with him do some father and son bonding do some fishing which we both love so much and um, yeah we had a great day so if you guys enjoyed it please shoot me a thumbs up uh, for you new guys if you haven't yet please subscribe and as always guys thank you very much and to next time tight lines Bye.